What we're seeing now uh, is what uh, scientists call an eruption or an invasion of of some uh, more unusual birds, um, finches. And so we call them winter finches, and there are a number of different species. And uh, what's going on here is that these are birds that uh, they breed uh, and live most of the time in really northern areas. So northern Michigan, the Upper Peninsula, that kind of um, northern forest, and then all throughout Canada as well. And they depend on the seeds of various trees. So kind of some of them are really tied to uh, pine trees. I think they can only eat the seeds of certain kinds of pines. Others uh, mainly eat the seeds of birches and other northern trees. And uh, every so often, every few years, these trees don't produce uh, as many seeds. Uh, and so the birds don't have as much food to survive that really cold northern winter, and they start to move south. And those movements can be really unpredictable and kind of uh, uh, erratic. So whereas a lot of, uh, when we think of birds migrating, like Canada geese migrating overhead, they go uh, south for the winter and um, come back north in the spring. And it's very regular and predictable in a lot of ways. With these birds, uh, they don't do these movements every year. And so what we're seeing in Michigan now um, is a kind of once every uh, several year um, invasion of these of these birds from these northern forests and part of the reason it's very um, uh, noticeable is that these are also birds that come to feeders uh, and so backyard bird feeders will attract some of these northern finches and so uh, people can see them really up close um, in their yards